Greetings everyone. In this video I want to talk about why the matrix creates for us when we are inside the box in our frequency levels. Greetings. This infinite source truth is made possible by the generous contributions and support of viewers like you. Please consider making a contribution now. Thank you. So, uh, why does the matrix create for us inside the box okay that's where duality is and when we are born into this life we have unlocked scripts and we are truly neutral we don't think we don't have fears we don't i mean a child they don't know what's good or bad they don't know they don't have prejudices they don't have uh, fears of anything you know until we tell them don't run out in the street don't touch that it's hot don't 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 until we tell them don't 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 or and this is good and that is bad until we start programming them and telling them what's good and bad for them and that is whenever we start to drop into lower frequencies and when we start eating meat, then that locks us into a lower frequency. Our scripts become locked at that point. Now, we have choices in those scripts, like I said, the choice doors, A and B. And sometimes we're giving a third choice, a C choice, which is the ability to create some things for ourselves without us even being aware of it. Very few source players have reached those doors and gone through them. Once you enter, your frequency lowers and you go into the box frequencies. Your thoughts are monitored. They have to be because you see the matrix has to remain balanced. And in order to do that, the matrix must know what you are thinking because you are not a conscious creator. Conscious creators are outside the box. They're in neutrality and they are, they know what this matrix is and they are creating their experiences consciously. They don't have to have the matrix creating them for them. Inside the box duality with all the rainbow colors is polarized your thinking mindset is duality and in order for the matrix to maintain the balance it has to read your thoughts you are in a script your script then becomes locked and you are stuck with the choices within that script. Occasionally there will be given a neutral door, a door that isn't a uh, duality door, and you will be able to unlock your script without really, with intent, uh, unlock it through removing the animal meat, flesh, blood, fish, and anything with heart, which is an automatic unlock if you have your frequency bodies match up. But there are occasional doors call them um, mystery doors that a third choice that's thrown in there that doesn't happen at every door every choice door but occasionally they will appear in a source player's life if they have taken certain doors that lead up to those three doors The matrix has to read a source player's uh, unconscious creator's thoughts in order to manifest their thoughts for them within the box. You see, because you're not creating them in your awareness. You've forgotten who you are and how powerful you are. You've given your energy away and in the matrix, we programmed, we programmed the matrix to create for us whenever we were not conscious enough to create for ourselves time to become a conscious creator raise your frequency 
get outside the box and then the matrix doesn't have to read your thoughts. You are outside of the matrix knowing. So the matrix we designed to create for us when we were unconscious and most source players right now are unconscious and they are in lower frequency ranges. You need to raise your frequency high enough to come into the neutrality zone, which is outside the box thinking, which is higher than the sky, and become a conscious creator. Then you are doing the creating, and the matrix is not simply doing it for you based on your thoughts and your frequency. The law of attraction does work for unconscious creators. Now, although the positive law of attraction doesn't work unless you have intentionally unlocked your script, and then the positive higher frequency laws of attraction will work for you. But you see, all of this was created so that if it's not causing you some pain to be down there in the lower frequencies, why would you have any inclination to rise to the top to escape this game? or to become a powerful creator. I mean, really, if you were experiencing your best not, you know, life yet in the lower frequency realms, would there be any reason to change? Not at all. You'd be stuck there. You would never have escaped this matrix. And the problem is too many of us have enjoyed this little game far too much. And we have given away to our emotions and our uh, material, physical desires. And we have enjoyed the game. A lot. And it's kept us here far too long. But this is your last time through. Make it your best life yet. Raise your frequency. Become a conscious creator and create your best life yet. You can do this. And if you have just found this information, then it would benefit you to go back and watch the previous videos that I have shared. In order to become a conscious creator, you have to remove the animal meat, flesh, blood, fish, and anything with heart from your foods consumed to be able to unlock your script with intent so that the higher frequency law of attraction will work for you and that you can become a conscious creator with your intent and not just experience your negative thinking. But I also strongly suggest that you keep your script locked with your intent until you are consciously unlocking it. But you're not going to be able to keep it locked and raise your frequency past a certain point. So you're still going to need to unlock it. If you found this information to be beneficial to you in your journey, then it is in your benefit to support this work as it unlocks things for you that you can unlock no other way. It is a frequency issue. Abundance, health, and prosperity to you.